become our student, and get access to effective and free educational materials. Do you know a bus that goes to the Gold Line Station? Do you live in Pasadena? My house is up in Altadena. You could always take the 264. It'll really take me to the station? It goes all the way there. Do you know what street it goes on? Catch it on Altadena Drive. I would have never known. Now you know. I appreciate you telling me. No problem. May I have a look at that vase, please? Of course. It's the best one I have here. And it's only 300 yuan. Oh, it's really nice, but to tell the truth, that's far too expensive. Really? Even for such an excellent one? Good morning, sir. Do you have a reservation? Yes. My name is Charles. I see. We have a window table reserved for you. It's very kind of you. Would you like to order now or wait for a while? Bring me the menu, please. Nowadays fewer and fewer people go to the movie theaters to see films. So I am afraid that the film studios are really getting hard time to survive. What you said is true. But the film producers there are more flexible ways to get more audience. For example, to make more movie CCDs, so people will spend money buying them. But it is true that cinemas are losing the attraction they used to have in the past. Yes. Take myself for example. I seldom go to cinemas, but it doesn't mean I no longer see films. Instead, I see films at home watching CCDs. Let's go now. I'll be with you in a minute. Dear, can you drive me to the clinic? I'm afraid I can't. Why? Well, my car won't start. I don't know what's the matter with it. Could it be the battery? No, I don't think it could be. I checked the battery two days ago. It must be other problems. Well, I suppose it could be the gas. No, there is plenty of gas. I filled it up yesterday. Perhaps it's the starter then? Yes, that's possible. Excuse me, will you please keep an eye on my suitcase? I just want to make a phone call. Certainly, but will it take long? No, I'll be right back. Okay, I'll look after it then. So how can I make it? First you make a list of what you wanna buy. But I've gotta have the budge before anything else. Well, that's a problem, isn't it? Mon and I got in another fight, Boris. Oh, Iris. What was it about this time? It was over food. I simply wanted some fried chicken but she said no. I believe she was right. You must know that fried foods contain a lot of fat. Oh, she keeps saying that. She never allows me to have them. I think you'd better take her advice since health is the greatest wealth. But, Boris, I am not a baby anymore. Well, that's true. How about your mother? She also believes in healthy diet. And she requires us to have regular meals. 
Poor you. It seems we are in the same boat. Oh, I am grateful for my mother on this point. Her idea of healthy eating helps me a lot keeping fit. Really? So you don't have fried food at all? Not really. I may have some occasionally for a chance. But I don't indulge myself too much. How do you manage it? It's pretty simple, Iris. Just keep it in mind that you're what you eat. Is learning the English language your toughest challenge yet? Become our student and get access to effective and free educational materials.